runners a very big round of applause. I'm glad that we finished our, our journey. We paddled the water and we walked the road. We were at the residential school also. I would like to thank Alberta and Yvonne for carrying my heavy load back for me. I feel so much lighter now. I feel really good and I'm sure that anybody that has participated with this event that does feel better. So kukuks piyayat why? Right from day one when we first started talking about our ceremony this weekend five weeks ago, there was a lot of things that needed to get done. And we learned on Friday that the well the best made plans will have to change. And there are so many times during the last three days we've had to change our agenda and you've probably seen some of it, like what's happening right now. In order to celebrate what we've done over this last three days, we want to gift each and every survivor from our community with a blanket. We're going to start blanketing our living survivors and we're going to call you up as a family unit. So if you hear your last name or your maiden name, please come up and join your family in the center. And if you have young people in your family that have not attended residential school, send them up with you and they will help with blanketing you. And the chair of First Nations Health Council be here with us. And we'd like to give Grand Chief a blanket.